welcome Northeast Missouri Angler. Today I'm out here fishing on the Mark Twain. Going to chase down some crappie. Sorry I haven't posted a video in a while between my work schedule and the guide trips. I've been pretty busy. Yeah. Today I'm going to use this eighth ounce thumper pillhead and killer chrome. And uh, I'm going to tip a, tip a minnow on there. Uh, is I take my minnow and I put it through his lips. That way he can swim. Just like that. And then drop down on some of these crappie. See if we catch something. Stick around. big tree out here in 29 foot of water. It's got a bunch of fish on it. I can't tell what size they are. Looks like there's a couple nice ones. Good one. Small one. A bunch of them down there. Small fish. They can't all be big. So like I said earlier. Big one's still there. He come and look for it, looked at it though. The little one's keeper. The little one's a 10 inch fish. Yeah. There we go. Eater, Took a few minutes, but there's another one. Nice eater. There's a big one down there. I'm trying to get him. He come up, looked at it, and that one come up and grabbed it before he got to it. <laughs> Good one. Eater. Eater. Yeah, eater. Got that one. It's not the big one though. <coughs> it's a good one. Ten inch fish. A good one. There's one. Not a monster, he's an eater. There we go. About nine inches. So nine inch fish, check him here. Got me a new fishing partner on the boat today. Yeah, he's a little over nine, but nine and a quarter. Introduce you to my fishing partner for today. We got Skeeter Dog on the boat. Mama's babysitting. But he's the he's the fishing partner for today. He licks everything I catch. Make sure it passes the Skeeter lick test. But this is his first time on the boat. So he's, he gets a little angry with me every now and then when I don't catch one quick enough. So you might hear him barking in the background. But he's, yeah, I smell like fish, don't I? Yep. <laughs> Papa caught one. Well, I was kind of keeping an eye on him because Thumper Jigs not only catches crappie, they'll catch weenie dogs too. Heard one. That fish came from. 10 foot of water. Another solid eater. Here we go. Good. You gotta check him out. You gotta give him a lick test. There he is. Give him a lick test. Yep, he approves. He thinks your Mark Twain crappie are good too. That 10 inch fish there. Boom. Better one. Good one. Ten and a half incher. Got a good one. Oh yeah. 
little over 10. He took it. It's a good one. That's a good one. Nice 10, 10 and a half inches. Take them like this all day. What do you think about that skier dog? Huh, you gonna give him a lick test? Does he taste all right? Yeah, he tastes pretty good, Dad. Let's see what we got here. Another good one. Yeah, you go. Solid 10, a little over. Look. Little one. Little one. Can't all be little. Or, they can't all be big. They can't all be little. <laughs> I've seen days when this is all you caught out here. Or what? Good one. Good one. Another 10 inch fish. Nice 10 inch eater. There we go. A nine and a half incher. Good eaters. No monsters, but plenty of eaters today. Gotcha. A little short striking some buck. Nine inch fish. Another one. There's 11. We ain't being going after all big, big fish today because it's going to get about 95 degrees. So if they're nine inches and over, they're going in the box. Yes. I think this is nine inches. He definitely one of the smaller ones today, that's for sure. He is nine. There he is. Yeah. <laughs> like I said, sometimes you just gotta let him look at it a little longer. Yeah, yeah. There you are right there. Nice 10 inch fish, sometimes better. They're just short striking that manna. Especially if you got live scope, you can put it right on top of them. You know exactly how deep they are. Fish on there. There's a keeper. There's a keeper. 14, ain't it? 14. Nice little nine and a half inch, 10 inch fish. He's got racing up there to get it. Yeah, they are. Like, who's gonna be first? He's on there. He, he, just a little one. Yeah. Little dude. Can't all be big. What? You wanna lick this one? You ain't got to lick one in a while. Lick. Hey, okay. he ain't gonna let it really lick it, so he must not have approved of that one. <laughs> There's a good one. There's a better one. How about that one? Hey, that one passed the lick test. By golly, he's licking on that one. Do you discriminate on licking by size, sir? <laughs> Well, that's it. That's about 15. A uh, couple hours this morning. Found them. Uh, fish I found were off the main bluffs, off this main body. Uh, I was fishing anywhere from 45 to 26 foot of water, but the fish were 8 to 16, 17 foot down. Uh, seemed like the bigger fish were a little deeper, uh, but I still managed to get a nice limit of, you know, 9.5 to 10.5 inch fish. Nice eater size in a couple hours. 
uh, get them while before it got hot. Can't beat that. Uh, like I said, sorry I posted a video in the last few, couple weeks. Uh, between my work schedule and the guiding I've been doing, I've been so busy I haven't been able to fish much on my own. Uh, I think I've been out three times on my own before today in the last three weeks. and Twice was at night and it was so dark and the bugs were so bad when I tried running cameras, headlights on so you could see with the cameras. It was just unbearable with all the bugs. So, And then the one time I went during the daytime and filmed, for some reason I didn't have any sound. So I figured I'd just keep trying until I get one that's worth watching, you know, where you can hear and see what's going on. But yeah, it uh, today I used the 8th ounce thumper pill head and killer chrome and was tipping it with a minnow. And uh, it was working great. Uh, fish are starting to pile up in groups. Uh, if you find them groups, especially if live scope, uh, if they seem like they're chasing or short striking, maybe pulling them in off or just biting the tail of your jig, switch over to a cork, a slipped cork, and uh, set the depth and put that over it and let it sit there and let them look at it for a couple seconds. A lot of times they'll grab it. Uh, like I said, this time of year I like using Menace from now until about September or so, into September, into October, and then I'll switch back to jigs. Seems like Menace is just a better bite. Uh, but yeah. But hey, remember, if you like what you watch, hit that subscribe button at the bottom, hit the bell right next to it, and it'll notify you when I post my videos. And as always, thanks for watching.